Uh, hey everybody, Lloyd from Armbrust uh, American. Uh, so one of the things that um, uh, we're trying to do always is trying to make these masks better. You know, we're not just sitting here okay to continue to produce millions of these things and, and not improve them. And so um, one of the biggest complaints that we get is, is around the nose wire. Um, the nose wire, you know, it, it, if it's not situated correctly, it's actually one of the most important structural parts of the mask because what it does is it allows you to sit on your face and it provides a seal if it's done correctly. Well, the nose wire in the masks that we're using now were, you know, developed, the whole thing in a way was designed in China because we've kind of had uh, a platform. This mask, you can consider it a platform that was developed uh, in China and, uh, and we're trying to improve it. So if I, if I take this uh, nose wire out here, you're gonna see this is like really, uh, it's, it's a one, uh, it's a three millimeter, uh, extruded wire. So they, what they do is they take a galvanized wire and then they extrude um, some uh, some plastic. We don't do any plastic here. We actually get a bunch of our nose wire from Mexico. Uh, it's one of the parts that we don't plan on making here just because I don't want to deal with metal, to be honest. So if you come in here, come in, coming down here. So you're going to see that these, uh, this is a really, really the single extruded piece of metal. It's actually very, very flimsy. And so we've been working with somebody to uh, to make this uh, a, a double thick and basically putting two wires in there. And so you can see how, hopefully the, the camera can see it. If you can, actually, let's just put it right down here. You're gonna see like, it is a, it's a tiny bit thicker, but it's got two wires in here. And those two, those extra wires um, are hopefully gonna give that a lot more strength, okay? So we've got, you know, some a roll of the, the dual strength wire here, and you see it on a roll, you can really see how much stronger it is. And it's just a lot, even when you're picking up two pieces of the different wire, like this is a lot more substantial, it's twice, it's twice the weight. Actually, that's gonna add to our shipping cost, I just realized, oh well. <laughs> All right, so um, to make this work, we've had to actually change uh, the design of our machine. I used to be in software, and if you wanna make a change in software, you just wake up one morning and say, hey, I want that button moved to the left, it's easy. Manufacturing is so much harder. It takes weeks and months sometimes to get the redesign. This is what our old uh, uh, wheel that guided the uh, the single uh, extruded wire, nose wire through. And you see it's got a groove in there that perfectly fits that. So we had to go back to the drawing board. Fortunately, we have a great partner here um, just down the road, about 15 minutes down the road. There's a, a metal shop that uh, actually does a lot of the parts for SpaceX. And you can see the difference in quality. Um, this is uh, an American-made piece here in uh, Texas, and this one is made in China. Uh, the metal is just a lot more pure, it's a lot more standard, and, and, and what we found is that we've been replacing parts and rebuilding and remanufacturing stuff, the parts are just so much better. So um, you can see this one now has two grooves on it, and that is gonna fit uh, the, uh, the new, newly designed piece of nose wire. We also, um, the, the wheels and the way it's cut, it doesn't provide a full cover. So it's not a, what we just call a full uh, a nose wire coverage. Um, so we're gonna extend that as well. And if you look at like this one, this was the one that, that he just cut out of the mask. You can see the difference in length. It doesn't seem like much, it's a couple millimeters, but that really does make a difference in the security. Now, I'm gonna do this live. I've never done this with this because we literally just got this a moment ago. So I'm gonna go ahead and Try this here. I'm just gonna feed it into the mask like that. Uh, hey, six feet, social distance. All right, I'm gonna try it here. Oh my gosh, that's so much stronger. So that hopefully will give a stronger seal and a more, uh, just a more robust mask altogether. So we're gonna continue updating this and, and making it better. So I guess, Jake, it's time to put this on the machine. Let's do it.